was one place to be in Tasmania overnight, the rooms of the victorious Tigers. <laughs> trying to rehydrate after the game so just a bit of water on me at the moment but um, it should be okay I need to have a shower. Earlier history was made as Elise Villani hit the winning runs to secure a nine wicket victory. The Tigers roar again in a final of Bill Reed, but for the first time it's the women's team. I'm so proud of them. Proud to have them represented the organisation and the state like you know it's about inspiring the next generation now so they did it. Villani named player of the match off the back of her unbeaten 111. Oh, look at the celebration. That's a captain century if ever there was one. Elise Villani, take a bow. Well, look at the smile on her face. And there was a good reason for it. After several attempts, it was her maiden WNCL title win. Team success is really important to me and it's really something that was playing on my mind of how many finals I've sort of been in and not being able to come away with the win. So today just makes it all the more special. In the biggest match of her career, local product Emma Mannix Jeeves also went big. And there's a century for the hometown girl. 100 not out. Well batted. Emma Mannix Jeeves. It was the perfect response from the Tasmanian who's forced her way back into the team after losing her contract. I mean, everything happens for a reason, and, and if this is the reason that I'm so grateful for everything that's happened. So. It's made me the cricketer I am today and the person I am today. To have uh, Elise Milani, a hardened professional cricketer, with Emma Mannix Jeeves, a, a homegrown product of our own program, got to win that game for us. That, that is exactly the poster that we were hoping to have. In a fitting end to her career, Corinne Hall was given a guard of honour. I'm very happy to finish on that. I don't think a lot of people get to choose to, to finish their careers these days and I feel very fortunate to do that, let alone have this send off. So. Yeah, I, I'm definitely done, I think. Yesterday's win is also special for Sasha Maloney, who's been with the team almost since its inception. It means everything. I'm a bit lost for, for words, to be honest. Um, I don't think I was expecting this to happen in my playing career. Ladies and gentlemen, your WNCL champions for season 2021-22, the Tasmanian Tigers! <laughs> To make this win even more impressive than it already is, the Tigers did it without three of their best players. Nicola Carey and Heather Graham who are on World Cup duties in New Zealand and Belinda Vaccarera who's on personal leave. Let's now hope this title winning squad can stay together and build a dynasty for Tasmanian cricket. We talk about creating history but I actually feel we've found the beginning. This is the start of something that's going to be absolutely incredible. Go in the Tigers! Brent Costello. Win News.